A hearty welcome here on Claw TV. Time and again, we've been hearing in our Western media about journalists being kidnapped in Ukraine. However, it is very conspicuous that concerning these kidnappings, reporting is often one-sided, putting the burden of the responsibility on the pro-Russian separatists. In numerous articles of the mainstream press, we read, for example, pro-Russian militia kidnap American journalist, or several foreign and local reporters were detained by pro-Russian powers, etc. Concerning the offenses of the government in Kiev, however, much less or nothing was reported. For example, that an Italian journalist and his Russian translator were killed by a Ukrainian army mortar grenade appears to be only worth a marginal note. Also the fact that this Italian reporter and his colleagues came under fire the moment he began to photograph the war operations is not only kept under cover by Western media, but also an investigation of the matter is not desired. They distract from these things. Also the arrest of two Russian journalists was completely swept under the carpet. These two journalists were held prisoners for a whole week, almost without food or water, under completely oppressive, inhuman conditions. For example, plastic bags were put over their heads and they were locked in a hole in the ground, to mention just some of the mistreatments they had to suffer. Both Russian media and the Russian government vehemently demanded the release of these reporters. This could only finally be reached, however, through further intervention by the president of Chechenian. In case you haven't heard about this, the reason is that nearly all Western media kept silent about it. This proves, yet again, that our media has double standards. Remember, just a few weeks ago, the detainment of the OSCE observers by pro-Russian militia caused a wave of indignation for days in the Western media landscape. Yet the same thing done by the government in Kiev is hardly mentioned in the same media. No cry of indignation rose up in spite of this blunt offense against freedom of press. In view of the tense situation in Ukraine, impartial, complete and truthful media coverage is immensely important. However, since this is not the case, just and courageous people are needed to help spread the countervoice. Valued viewers, please help to prevent worse escalation of the situation by telling as many friends and acquaintances as possible and send this link to your family and relatives. Thank you for helping. Good evening to you.